This is Kayla Kelly. Investigators want you to look at her face, listen to her name, and call them immediately if you might know where she is, because deputies have looked for days and still can't find her. Deputies did, though, find the man accused of kidnapping her, and they want you to look at him, too, because they believe if they know where he's been and who he's dealt with recently, they might be able to bring Kelly home. 32-year-old O'Coster Ferguson, also known as Kevin Brown, was arrested for her kidnapping Saturday. He's behind bars at the Collin County Jail, his bond set at $1 million. But whatever evidence investigators got to charge him still isn't enough to find her. The public sees things every single day and they just don't realize it. Donna Owen is a retired special agent with the FBI, told me investigators really rely on the public's help in cases like these to fill in the gaps. It's basically a backtracking of finding a timeline of how their paths intersected. Here's what investigators have revealed of their timeline so far. Friends reported Kelly missing on January 11th, after she'd been missing for several days. And sometime after that, they found her car. Was she transported to another vehicle or transported back to that vehicle? Now, deputies won't reveal exactly where it was, but they did confirm they located that car in a remote area of Frisco. Oh, is there familiarity to that area or not? Is it a dump site? Just a handful of so many questions investigators need to answer if they haven't already. In Collin County, I'm Sydney Persing.